More than 250 cruise ship passengers, including 34 Georgians, are wrapping up their second day under quarantine at Dobbins Air Force Base. They were flown to Cobb County after the coronavirus hit the Grand Princess cruise ship. Hope Ford spoke to one woman who says emotions are high. On day two at Dobbins, people started raising concerns. One person tells us a meeting between passengers and officials with the Department of Health and Human Services got heated Thursday morning. There was a lot of angry people, a whole lot of angry people. Teresa Duncan Johnson arrived at Dobbins Wednesday. She's been updating her social media with videos and pictures. She describes the base as hotel-like except for the fencing surrounding the quarantine zone. They're free to move around as long as they wear masks. But anxiety is settling in. Johnson says they've yet to be tested for the coronavirus. Full while we were on the ship, that everybody would be tested before we got off the ship. We thought, okay, when we get to Dobbins, they'll test us. As of today, Nobody's been tested. Outside of testing, Johnson says several people are upset over being forced to stay. They would take measures to prevent you from leaving. That would probably be very unpleasant. While Johnson is fine with the idea of staying the full 14 days, she says others feel like they're being treated like criminals. And they're questioning why are we not allowed to go go home then and self-quarantine. On top of those concerns, Johnson tells me her husband is running low on insulin and they're struggling to find out how or when they'll manage to get more.